I bet you don't do dips as I ask you now. In this video, I challenge you to do dips with me the way and pace I will do. I'm gonna tell you why. What's up guys, it's Adam from GymnasticsMethod.com. If you don't wanna miss my videos about bodyweight training and lifestyle, please subscribe and click on the bell. Thank you. And if you wanna get access to all the Gymnastics Method workout programs, tutorials like planche, handstand or muscle up, nutrition guide, daily workouts and much more, click the link below and join now on GymnasticsMethod.com. So, in this video, we're gonna do dips the way, in my experience, most people never do. But what is this secret kind of dips that I challenge you for and say many people never do? This is the regular dip. In full range of motion with a normal tempo. Yes, this is it. People usually don't do nice regular dips. At least I never see them. I don't know what your experience is, maybe I see this all the time, but same as with other exercises in the previous videos, I was thinking to do a real life challenge or test with dips as well. This is nothing fancy or trendy, but a real honest mirror about your basic strength. I mentioned this in my previous videos that sometimes there are many trends of challenges or exercises that people focus on that they just forget the basics and don't understand why they don't improve. That's why I want to draw your attention to these really important basics and surprisingly I get many positive feedback about the previous challenges and tests. Like finally a realistic challenge and people saying that they barely succeeded but it helped them to realize what they missed for so long etc. However, I know there are athletes who can eat these challenges for breakfast and that means that they really have those proper basics. But unfortunately, this is not that true in general. I made a video about how to do dips, what are the prerequisites and how to build it up properly, so if you haven't watched it yet, definitely check it out before you start this challenge. Opinions are divided what the right dips are like. It's really important to have the right shoulder mobility, scapular stability and pushing strength. If you have all these and you do the dips in the biggest possible range of motion, you can expect better results. Most people do dips in half range of motion. This basically makes the rings muscle up impossible since you don't use a range that you need in the rings muscle up. There is a range of motion in the dips that you'll be weak in. For the rings muscle up, you obviously need to do nice dips on the rings as well, but it's gonna be really difficult if you don't have that on the deep bars. If you've never done rings muscle up, but you want to learn it, you can test the movement with your legs on the ground and see how low should you go during the dips. Try to do it in an honest way with minimal load, don't skip the point. Drive the rings in the transition to the support and see where it is. You may experience lack of shoulder mobility, but at least you'll have the answer why you can't do full range of motion dips. And if you're interested in the five checkpoints of the perfect rings muscle up, check out that video on the channel. On the other hand, if rings muscle up don't motivate you to do the full range of motion dips, then think about this. The bigger the range of motion is, the better your gains are. So before you say that the full range of motion dips are unhealthy, watch my videos on how to do dips and spoiler alert, spend more time on shoulder mobility, scapula stability and basic pushing strength with push-ups. If you take my advice and learn the proper dip, let's see this test. 10 to 15 regular dips with the right implementation and tempo I show you with 2 minute rest between sets. 10 to 15 reps for the reason because in my opinion if you can do even 10 reps 3 times that's a decent level. The 15 reps is the top because after that in my opinion it's worth to move forward with advanced variations on the rings or using weights. The rest time between sets can be shorter if you feel that's enough for you but in my experience most people will need the 2 minute rest. Before you start I suggest you to warm up and do your prehab routine. You can find a complete 5 minute warm up video and plenty prehab videos on the channel in the prehab series. And if you're interested in the complete gymnastics method prehab routine, beginner, intermediate and advanced programs, click the link below and join now on gymnasticsmethod.com. To do this test the most honest way, place your phone or laptop in front of you, watch my moves and do the whole set with me. To make it even easier to follow, I also count the repetitions. You know everything you need and now let's see the challenge. I'm gonna count the reps like this and down, and up, and down, and up, and down, and up. The word end means the lower or upper end point of the exercise where you need to be still, but after you heard the word, you need to do the movement. Down means the eccentric movement and up means the concentric movement. Are you ready? Let's get it. And down, and up, and down, and up, 
and down and up 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 Let's get into the second set. And down and up. 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 And down and up 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 and down and up
Let's get into the last set. And down, and up, 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 and down, and up. How was it? Let me know in the comments how many reps you did per set. If you could do even only 8 to 10 reps 3 times, that's a good level. I suggest you to keep working, even do the sets with less reps or after you're out of gas, use a regression to finish the reps up to 15. If you succeeded, congrats, you have a decent basic strength. If you are able to do 15 reps like this, then I suggest you to make the exercise more intensive with using rings or weights. If you want to build strength and size, it's rather worth to do more intensive variations than working on high reps, but this is only my two cents and experience. So once again, I would be happy to hear about your results in the comments. And if you're interested in the complete, proven to work gymnastics method system, you want to learn all the most effective and iconic gymnastics and calisthenics exercises with the proper sets and reps, and want to get the shredded physique of a gymnast, click the link below and join now on gymnasticsmethod.com. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you found this video helpful, if you did so, please like, share and write a comment what do you want to see in the next videos. If you don't want to miss the new videos, subscribe with notifications on and see you next week in the next video.